Hello everyone and welcome back to a new video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to warp text on PixelR. So if you guys want to learn how to do it, just follow the steps that I'm going to show you. As you can see guys, I'm right now on PixelR e, uh, image editor. So the first thing that you need to do guys is go to the left side of your screen. And right here, you're going to find all of the tools. So you need to search for text. Once you find it, go ahead and click on it. And then right here, you're going to click on add text. And then you can type anything that you want. For example, I'm going to type warp text. So once you type your text, you can come right here. You can click on edit if you want to edit the text. Right here, you're going to find fonts. So I, I'm using right now Arial. But if you click here, you can choose any uh, font that you want. For example, I'm going to choose uh, this one. Right here, you can change the size. So we're going to make it a little bit bigger. And you can also uh, right here change the format. So you can either increase or decrease the line space, the letter space. You can change the alignment. So I'm going to keep it in the center. You can make it bold. Uh, add an uppercase, make it italic, add an underline. And uh, right here, you can change the color of the text. For example, we're going to choose this color. And lastly, in order to warp this text, go to styles. And then right here, you're going to find a lot of options. As you can see, guys, right here, you're going to find warp. So go ahead and check this. And then right here, you can either uh, choose uh, upper middle or lower so for example i'm going to choose uh, middle you can also right here choose either you want a uh, circular or angular so i'm going to choose angular and right here you can change the uh, edge size the center size the horizontal effect the uh, vertical offset and also horizontal offset for example i'm going to choose this one Change the vertical offset. And right here, as you can see, guys, you can uh, change some other settings like background, outline, shadows, and also uh, curves. And once you finish, then just click X. And as you can see, guys, the changes are saved. Thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video.